Hello, darlings, and welcome to Fashion Connect. You know how we do? Here we talk about all the fashionable things that we are connecting with. And today's episode is no different because I am connecting with, if my outfit is any indication, you guessed it, the colored suit. Now, the colored suit is out in the moment on social media. Everybody has done it, from Tokamakunwa to Bonang Mateba to all bloggers, style influencers and fashion enthusiasts. Everybody has done it. What are you waiting for? In case you're wondering, I don't know what color to buy. I don't know how to wear it. Listen, it comes in an array of colors. There's tons of them, from the shy pastels to the very bold colors. Red, pink, greens, and the minty, lilac shades, you have them all. Now, if you don't know what to do, don't you worry. I am here to break it down for you in terms of how to style it, colors, and where you can get them. Stay tuned. Right guys, let us start. We're going to count down from five to one. At the number five, in no particular order really, but you know, to make it easy, we're going to start at number five with Mimi Onalaja. Now Mimi is wearing this absolutely gorgeous yellow suit by uh, Lady by Lady Bieber, that's the brand. And it looks really good. It's double breasted, which I really, really like. Mine is single breasted and it fits her. So um, for any of you out there who might be thinking, well, shape wise, I feel like I'm tiny at the top and big at the waist. This double breasted is always a good choice. You can't go wrong with it because it cinches you in and and just flares that slightly at the waist and it just makes heaps so and it makes you look really good like a woman so if you want your womanly curves enhanced this style is for you right at number four guys i'm going to take it to this absolutely gorgeous style influencer jadot fashion her name is stella stella looks absolutely adorable in this blue number really really love it some of you might say it's like lilac actually it is blue and i love the way she spared it down with sneakers and a white t-shirt it looks absolutely gorgeous and the reason i liked it is because the jacket itself is cropped so if you have a boyish figure this crop jacket can actually look really good on you because it means this top halfway like at your waist and it makes you look like you've got much longer legs, makes you leaner. So if you're worried about maybe not knowing how to wear it, if you're very lean, crop jackets are always a good choice. So this one at number four by Stella of Jador Fashion is a winner. All right, darlings, at number three, I'm going to give it to Damilola of Idawa Fashion. Damilola is a Manchester City-based fashion blogger, and Damilola has actually won the color suit in multiple colors. She's done, uh, I'm sure she's done like yellow and green and blue. She's done a lot of them, and she styles them really well. What I really like about her is that she's done them in different versions, where she's either dressed it up with high heels and dressed them down in uh, flats with hats, you can do whatever you want to do. The other thing is this, if you're not sure about sizing, sometimes you get it, they're too tight, so you know, they might fit a bit snug, a bit loose. If you just let them open, they hang better sometimes. So think about it, think about what you want to wear inside and make it an accessory, and then just leave it hanging open. So for me, at number three, Damilola Vidawa Fashion, she cinched it. Number two has got to be for this, absolutely gorgeous adorable person Bonang Muteba I absolutely love her maybe I'm a little bit biased when it comes to Bonang because her outfit this suit it's orange in color it's vibrant it's popping it's like a bit of summer sunshine splash to away which I really really like but at the same time it's not the tapered style trousers now the reason that I picked this the jacket is also double breasted the reason I picked it is because there are lots of you out there who say they don't want to wear tapered trousers because they feel it doesn't fit them very well pencil trousers make them feel uncomfortable because yes sometimes it does make you look like you're very tiny around the ankles and really big at the top so if you're not comfortable you can do like bunning and just wear a long trousers, long fitted trousers that aren't tapered, you know, it's just like flared sometimes, but not too flared. Basically what I'm trying to say is I suppose regular trousers. And then the jacket again is double breasted. I wear it if you're not feeling too sure and you want to cinch your waist or just wear it and leave it open as well, you can do either. So um, I really, really love hers. I think it's from Woolworths, she said, that's what she tagged anyway, Woolworths in South Africa. But um, if that doesn't work for you and you can't get to Woolworths like me, you can definitely check out other ones I'm going to mention from other stores you can get them from. All right, darlings, here we are finally at number one. Number one has got to go to this absolutely beautiful person, Toke Makinwa. Really love her. She's the blogger that we all know, the author that we all know, and of course, the designer that we all love. Now, Toke is wearing this red number. This is from Zara. My suit is also from Zara. And Zara is on a number of colors in this suit. And Toke Makinwa's one is no different. But the thing is, hers is the tuck star. So it's slightly above in price range but i like Tokes one because it is it just adds that little bit of dressiness to it and i love the way she styled it she's kept it all red from top to bottom so you can always do that you know find one color stick to it in different tiny variations 
of shades of the same color and it always works wonders because what that does for you is it streamlines you and makes you slimmer than you really really are so there you are that's my five top fashion connect for colored suits now in terms of the one i'm connecting with the most i.e style and color well wait for it of course it's like a marking one number one yes the reason being that i love the way she has styled it and kept the colors all the same both accessories and the suit itself like i said it makes you look just that little bit more slimmer than you really are if you keep all your styling in the same color palette it really does work wonders right guys that's it for this week fashion connect i hope you enjoyed it before i go just very very quick tip on how you can style them like i said you can dress it up and up or dress them down like i've done here in my white trainers and the white t-shirt under the color suit for one thing white tends to tone down a bright color if you're feeling a bit shy and if you are bold and you want to go even bigger you can dress it up like tokemakingwa did keep everything in the same color palette or if you're even bolder, clash it. You can wear pink with like an orange or lime green top on the inside. Trust me, it does look amazing. Just find a way to accessorize with accessories and make sure they all come together. Now, if you're like me and your days get busy and in the evening you need to go out but without needing to get home, pack a pair of simple sandals in your bag. You don't even need to do anything else. Put a pair of sandals on and all of a sudden you elevate your look. It makes such a difference. For guys out there, check out Ugomose. He's wearing his white suit and actually his trainers are more on the white or off-white side and his hat is also in the same color shade makes him look slim i mean he's really slim already anyways but it makes him look really really streamlined so if you guys don't know how to dress this will give you clues shops to get them from almost all high street shops have got them zara is a very popular one there's next there's new look and then of course online boohoo uh asos pretty little things you name them, there's countless of them. So you do not have any excuse not to try the color suit for the summer, guys. So that is it from me. I am out to have some fun, have some tea. I'll see you guys next week. Bye for now.